So here we are, we're at it again. Uh, this time we're going to build the Hasty Hydro and uh, we're going to take this slowly step by step. The Hasty Hydro is another sea fleet designed by William Jackson who also did the Minimax and the Minimost and we're going to use our full size plans that we have available on our website and uh, we're going to take you through these uh, uh, building steps uh, a little bit at a time and uh, we'll see what happens. So uh, come on with me here, let's uh, build another boat. The Hasty Hydro is an 8-foot three-point hydroplane, uh, which means it runs on two sponsons that are on either side at the front here, one here and one here. And it's these sponsons that allow any sort of seafly or hydroplane to uh, pick up more speed because what happens is as the boat comes up on plane, the only thing that's really touching the water are the tips of these sponsons here and the very back part of the transom. Here's the full-size plans that we have available for sale on our website. It's also important to know that you don't need full-size plans to build any sea fleet. The full-size plans simply make things a little bit easier for you. The other thing I've done is I've made duplicate pieces on the full-size plans here. So in this case, this is a cutout of the lower transom frame and the upper transom frame. So you can cut these out, actually glue them to the wood, and then cut around these. At the same time, I've also included a full-size transom template where you can glue the pieces right on here. What is going to be very useful if you use these full-size plans is the cutouts for the sponsons. These are actual size. I've made them so you can cut them out, glue them to the actual wood, and then make the appropriate cuts here. I've also included the right sponson end blocks and the sponson sides. The first thing I have to do is I have to cut at the bottom and the side planks from this 4x8 sheet of plywood. This is 3 8 inch thick. It's good one side plywood that I just purchased from Home Depot yesterday. And this single sheet here will give me the bottom of the Hasty Hydro plus the two side planks. The bottom plank is 34 inches wide by 96 inches long. And if I cut things right, I should have enough material here to get the bottom fabricated together. Because the edge of this plywood has a lot of splinters, I'm just going to take my belt sander to it and just smooth it out a bit. So here's the easiest thing in the world to do. The plans call for an arc of a 20 inch radius. I've marked the center line, 17 inches, and then the 20 inches down along the center. We just take a string and a pencil and measure the pencil out to 20 inches and draw the arc. And that's all it is.